हेलो स्टूडेंट्स आई एम शैलेश प्रजापति फ्रॉम सारस्व स्कूल टुडे आई विल टीच यू इन द सेट थियोरी चैप्टर वन पीरियड थ्री इन द लास्ट पीरियड वन एंड पीरियड टू आई जस्ट बेसिक एक्सप्लेन यू इन पीरियड टू वन ऑफ द नल सेट सो आई जस्ट रिवाइज यू ओनली स्टूडेंट्स नल सेट फाइनाइट इनफाइनाइट एंड इक्वल सेट एंड इन फर्स्ट पीरियड आई एक्सप्लेन यू रोस्टर फॉर्म एंड एलिमेंट्री फॉर्म एंड बेसिक कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ सेट थियोरी इन दिस सेशन पीरियड थ्री आई जस्ट एक्सप्लेन यू सबसेट ये स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज अ न्यू वर्ड फॉर यू सबसेट्स सबसेट्स इज वेरी इजी डेफिनेशंस कंसिडर एक्स इज अ सेट ऑफ ऑल स्टूडेंट्स इन योर इन योर स्कूल एंड वाई सेट इज अ सेट ऑफ ऑल स्टूडेंट्स इन योर क्लास सो definitely you can check the why element are present in set of x that's why why subset of x yes students here last the symbolically given the reverse d form it is called a subset means every element of y here means all students in your class definitely present in your school means in the present x that's why students i show every element of y present in x that's why i just explain you for the simple base way to x is a i mean y is a subset of x so generally this drawing here if you draw these are the one of the set y definitely this y is present in the whole set of x this is your whole set of x this a outsider is your set of x so every element of y present in the x so i just write down y subset x this y subset x means again repeat every element of y present in x so next move ahead continue a set a is said to be subset of every element is b so element a is also an element b means in previous definition i explain you x and y related here i explain you a and b related so it is generally symbolically we apply that a subset b and it define as the follows a subset b means small a belongs to a definitely small a belongs to b one more drawing i just give you students consider here one of the set a given and here that element given a and so b is a higher than value b a so here of the one of the b given outsider data is b and inside the data is a so you check out small a present in a as well as present in b that call you just apply a subset b next i give you some example first of all you known that a real number r in the real number r two types of data one of the rational and one of the irrational but students here rational is always subset to r similarly irrational number is also subset to r so q is a subset to r one more example a is a set of divisor of 56 same as b is a set of all prime divisor of 56 so finally b is a subset of a so stay here students every element of b here present in a that's why we call here b subset a next let a is a 135 and b is a odd natural number less than 6 definitely they are same it means a subset b and b subset a so both are equal here a equal b here yes, students here definition one more time revise to equality when they equal every element of a and every element of b are same then we can say equal but here students see a subset b it means every element of a present in b and b subset a is means every element of b present in a 
सो हियर ऑल्सो अनदर डेफिनेशन वी कैन कॉल ए इक्वल बी नेक्स्ट ए इज अ ए आई ओ यू एंड बी इज अ ए बी सी डी सी हियर नॉट दे आर एग्जैक्टली सेम प्रेजेंट इन ए टू बी आइदर बी टू ए सो वी कैन नॉट से ए इज अ सबसेट ऑफ बी एंड वी कैन नॉट से बी इज अ सबसेट ऑफ ए नेक्स्ट एग्जाम्पल नाइन नल सेट ए वन थ्री बी वन फाइव नाइन एंड सी वन थ्री फाइव सेवन नाइन एक्सप्रेस यू सिम्बॉलिकली सबसेट और नॉट सबसेट स्टूडेंट्स येस फर्स्ट सिम्बॉल इज सबसेट सेकेंड सिम्बॉल इज नॉट सबसेट सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल नल सेट इज अ सबसेट ऑफ एवरी सेट अगेन रिपीट यू नल सेट इज अ सबसेट ऑफ एवरी सेट नल सेट मीन्स वॉट स्टूडेंट्स देर इज नो एलिमेंट इन द गिवन सेट सो नल सेट इज ऑलवेज सबसेट टू एवरी सेट सो माई फर्स्ट आंसर इज अ नल सेट सबसेट बी सेकेंड वन सेकेंड वन ए नॉट सबसेट बी बिकॉज नॉट एवरी एलिमेंट ऑफ ए प्रेजेंट इन बी दैट्स वाई ए नॉट सबसेट टू बी कंटिन्यू थर्ड वन ए एंड सी रिलेटेड येस ए इज अ प्रेजेंट इन सी सो स्टूडेंट्स हियर जस्ट आई ड्रॉ टू सिंपल ड्रॉइंग फॉर योर मोर अंडरस्टैंडिंग हियर ए गिवन सेट एंड आउटसाइडर डेफिनेटली यू हैव टू सी सेट दिस इज अ सी सेट देन ए एलिमेंट्स आर प्रेजेंट इन सी अगेन रिपीट यू स्टूडेंट्स वेन द सबसेट अप्लाय एवरी एलिमेंट ऑफ ए present in the next part to c therefore i can say here it is a subset c next fourth one b and c relations so you check out yes here also b present in the c so here also drawing wise just i explain you for simple drawing see this is your b set and outsider is your c set this is your c set outsider is a c set and internal is a b set so surely you can say b every element are present in c so my answer is definitely b subset c so easily students you understood your example 9 next 10th one a set a e i o u and b a b c d a subset b no they not present a in present of b similarly b elements are not present in set a so finally directly i show here a and b are not present in set b but here i draw to drawing wise so you easily understood students just here look at that i just one drawing to set a and the internal elements just i declare to you one of the a one of the e one of the i one of the o and one of the u but sure b have the one element is repeated so b your b set is that given to this sides this is your b sets here a b set is present to including a not a exactly a only one element a is a common that other elements are here you show one by one in the b here b may be here c and here d this one in the present of d okay but not exact element of a present in b that's why we cannot say here it is a subset so my answer is finally after that we can show a never subset b and b never subset a that's your finally answer this is a not subset huh? okay done next one example 11 A, B, and C are the three sets. A belongs to B. B subset C. It is true. Means some element of A present in B. It is true that A subset C. Okay, I just check out. A consider one element. B consider one and two. C consider one, two, three. So A belongs to B. They are check out B subset C, but they not meaning for apply A. subset c yes students your answer is a not subset c because every element of a not present in the c here curly bracket a given na not the only one given so not that element of set can never be subset of itself next subset of set of the real numbers very easy you know that natural number n 1 2 3 4 5 
z also known you integers minus negative numbers zero and positive numbers q you known that rational number it's always p by q forms and q never be zero and after that these all values are present in the set of the real numbers Irra irrational numbers you know students irrational number means uh, just to explain you in the form of consider this your r r have totally two child one of the q and one of the i this is our two child one of the q and one of the i but both are never to never same number q is called a rational number and i is called a irrational number and this is a full data is your r this is your full data is your r so r is a one of the big father and they have two child q for rational and i for irrational so both of the complementary events eh? next so n subset z z subset q also q subset r and i subset is also r my mistake here i not mention so that's why i written i for irrational number is also subset r okay t is written the uh, irrational number t and i is both same huh? so finally n is not subset t because natural number is not belonging to that parts of the irrational number so next continue now i explain you intervals students it is a new topic for the intervals new topic for the intervals so there are four types of intervals close close open open close to open and open to close so first i explain you in the real set a to b r set of the real numbers it is a called open interval is indicated by in open bracket a comma b students in open bracket a comma b means nothing a number not counted b number not counted on the natural number so just i explain you one of the drawing wise a and b so a and b numbers so our a are open bracket and b is a open bracket open bracket means nothing a not belonging in this number line b not belonging in this number line between number is a belonging to a and b so that call this interval is called open open value i mean a value not counted b value not counted but between is all number are counted so this interval are called open a to open b next close to close close to close means a number counted b number counted and between all number counted see i given this figure close bracket to a close bracket b and both are the dark circle given see and between green line i mean sorry between blue line it is indicate your answer present in a and b so one more time repeat there are the two intervals first interval generally four intervals two interval i here i explain and other two are next slide so first interval open open so a and b not counted between number counted and second one close to close it means a counted b counted and between number all counted now third third is a we can intervals in the third in the close to open see students close a comma b in open given it means close a means a number counted and open b means b is not counted just see this drawing a have dark circle positions it means a is a countable value and b is a open circle given means b is not countable but between number is counted between number is every time counted huh? so this interval is called open interval one of the close to open and last open to close open to close means a counted not b counted a is not included b is included just see the drawing so a in the open circle part given between is blue line is given the counted number and b is, is also dark circle position given means it is a close so finally there are four intervals one of the open open second close close third close to open and fourth open to close so generally four types of 
intervals you applying in any real numbers it means number line now next one for an example see this figure questions minus 5 to less x less or equal to 7 so students here minus 5 not counted 7 is counted so this interval is called open to close and your answer in the set builder form in this form you apply just answer minus 5 to 7 either another examples i just show out sorry this i drawing i mention you then you easily explain to this type of drawing see this your number line minus 5 to 7 you known here your minus 5 and here your 7 but students your question is what my question is a open to close means this number is not countable means 5 is not counted 7 is countable it means these are the dark circle and this between is all values means this data is included between all up to 5 to 7 but not minus 5 counted other data is counted clear so this interval is called open to close this only for example students one more examples i give you open close bracket minus 3 to open bracket 5 means minus 3 now counted 5 not counted so that type is drawing also I, if you draw then you easily understand this is a meaning see this your number line minus 3 2 5 here consider here minus 3 consider here 5 so 5 is not countable but minus 3 is countable and between all values is countable here is a minus 3 and here is a 5 okay so minus 3 are countable value between all number counted huh? and not countable to 5 next one now next point is called power set power set is nothing it is a subset of big part i mean it is a big brother of subset in simple definition see collection of all subsets of a set is called a power set it is defined by p of a p of me a means power set of a and is element in the set notations for example a is a 1 comma 2 there are two elements given so how many power set here available yes definitely there are four power set one of the null set individual one individual two and one two are combined so total you countable students it is totally four set so there are four subsets here you declare in the set notation so these are one these are two these are three and these are four there are four subsets to given set of a generally it is a basic formula number of the power set of a n for number indicate p a for power set is equal to 2 raised to m and m is indicate given how many elements in the set again repeat m is indicate given how many elements in this set so here definitely it is two element given so i just apply here two and apply that two raised to two it is a four so my sum is over there are four set apply in the set notation so it is a power set over next now universal set universal set see students these all are the simple simple definition huh? up to null set to universal set all are the basic definition in the given set universal set you know that every element belong in this set for universal it means it is indicated by u and it is subset by the all letters just like a english alphabet a b c d e f g up to x y z all are present in english alphabet so english alphabet is a, itself a universal set an internal part a b c d is that belonging part so for an example r is a real numbers so you know that in real numbers update that a human population studies the universal set consists of all people in the world it is called universal set next now 1.3 x i start make correct statement for the subset or not a subset very easy I just check out subset or not subset 2 3 4 check out present in the second given set yes it is present 
सो माई आंसर इज बिटवीन मैंसन सबसेट ये स्टूडेंट्स दिस सिम्बॉल इज कॉल्ड सबसेट आई जस्ट हाईलाइट दिस सिम्बॉल दिस सिम्बॉल इज कॉल्ड सबसेट दिस अ बिटवीन आई रिटर्न ओके नेक्स्ट ए बी सी प्रेजेंट इन बी सी डी नो ए नंबर नॉट प्रेजेंट सो माई आंसर इज अ इट इज अ नॉट अ सबसेट थर्ड एक्स इज अ स्टूडेंट ऑफ क्लास इलेवन ऑफ योर स्कूल एंड एक्स इज अ स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ योर स्कूल येस डेफिनेटली यू कैन जज इजीली इट इज योर सबसेट ऑफ द स्कूल नेक्स्ट फोर्थ वन सर्कल इन अ प्लेन एंड सेकेंड सर्कल इन अ सेम प्लेन विद द रेडियस वन सो वेरी इजी यू इजीली जज दिस आंसर इज अ नॉट अ सबसेट बिकॉज पर्टिक्युलरली रेडियस वन इंडिकेट सर्कल इज ओनली वन बट हियर सर्कल इन अ प्लेन इज मेनी सो इफ यू दिस क्वेश्चन आर रिवर्स गिवन देन इट इज अ सबसेट प्रेजेंट हियर माई आंसर इज अ नॉट अ सबसेट नेक्स्ट कंटिन्यू वन पॉइंट थ्री क्वेश्चन नंबर फर्स्ट कंटिन्यू सम एक्स सज दैट एक्स इज अ ट्राइंगल इन अ प्लेन एंड सेकेंड रेक्टेंगल इन अ प्लेन माई आंसर इज नॉट अ सबसेट because they not present in the rectangle according to length breadth wise sixth an equilateral triangle next given triangle in a same plane here also i easily judge my answer is a subset because equilateral triangle present in any triangle ha huh. but if you students here given any plane of a triangle that and present in the equilateral triangle answer is not a subset but this answer is a subset because equilateral triangle present in any types of triangle in a plane next even natural number you know that even natural number 2 4 6 it is a integer yes definitely my answer is a subset next second one examine statement true or false a comma b present in given yes present but here written not subset so my statement is false actually my answer is a subset second a present in the vowel english alphabet yes present and it is given that subset so my answer is definitely subset and it is a true third 1 2 3 present in the 1 3 5 no so my answer is false actually given it is a subset but two number is not present in the given set second 1 3 5 so two is not belonging to 1 3 5 that's why my answer is a false second one continue question number 4 a is a subset of abc yes definitely it is true because the belonging the set fifth a belong abc students here check left side a set given right side a set given so between never written belongs to it is a set written either not a set but here written belongs to so my question is wrong so my answer is false and 6 even natural number less than 6 natural number divisible by 6 you easily check even natural number 2 comma 4 and secondly divisible by 36 1 2 3 4 6 9 12 18 36 36 definitely 2, 4 is present in the second set so my answer is purely true next third question a given 1 2 3 4 is a combine na huh? it means 3 4 is a one element only so in given set how many element 1 2 3 4 is only one calculated and 5 means total four elements are given and i just check the question incorrectly 3 comma 4 is subset of a no it is a belongs to next 3 comma 4 is belongs to a yes it is true because it is a element third 3 comma 4 in curly bracket to curly bracket given subset of a my answer is a true because it is a subset to itself and fourth one belongs to a yes it is the member of a so my answer is true whenever you member written then it is a belongs to just like a students we are member of saraswat school we are member of wapi we are member of walsad but if you all member are calculated in the walsad sure all member of walsad is a set of whole member of gujarat 
अगेन होल मेंबर ऑफ गुजरात मेंबर्स श्योरली सबसेट ऑफ दी होल मेंबर ऑफ इंडिया इन होल मेंबर ऑफ इंडिया इज अ सबसेट ऑफ होल्ड आवर एशियन कंट्री एशियन कॉन्टिनेंट आइदर होल्ड वर्ल्ड ओके जेट लाइक नेक्स्ट वन सबसे डे नो वन इज नेवर सबसे डे बिकॉज वन इज अ एलिमेंट ऑफ ए सो इट इज अ बिलोंग्स टू एक्चुअली दिस इज अ इन करेक्ट स्टेटमेंट कंटिन्यू सिक्स वन वन टू फाइव इज अ सबसेट ऑफ ए सो इट इज अ करेक्ट बिकॉज इट इज सबसेट वन टू फाइव बिलोंग्स टू ए नो इट इज नॉट बिलोंग इट इज अ सबसेट एंड लास्ट एट वन वन टू थ्री इज अ सबसेट ऑफ ए इजीली आई डिफाइन वन टू थ्री एक्चुअली थ्री इज अ नॉट बिलोंग्स टू ए सो माई स्टेटमेंट इज इन करेक्ट वन मोर नाइन्थ वन नल सेट बिलोंग ए स्टूडेंट दिस इज आई एम पी क्वेश्चन है ना नल सेट बिलोंग ए नल सेट ऑलवेज सबसेट ऑफ एनी सेट अगेन रिपीट यू नल सेट ऑलवेज सबसेट टू एनी सेट इट इज नेवर बिलोंग्स टू एनी सेट सो दिस स्टेटमेंट इज ऑलवेज इन करेक्ट एंड नल सेट सबसेट ए डेफिनेटली यू नोन दैट ट्रू ऑलरेडी आई एक्सप्लेन इन द नाइन्थ वन and next one 11th null set already given in the curly bracket so it is a set huh? and set is a subset of a your answer is a statement is a incorrect next write down the subsets of the following subsets you formula known 2 raised to m wise so one of the a elements say one of the null set and a both are our two subset second a comma b so there are four subsets one of the null set individual a individual b and combined to a comma b next one more 1 2 3 so there are eight total subsets null set first individual 1 individual 2 individual 3 now two two pairing 1 2 1 3 2 3 and last pairing up to 1 2 3 so total you counted there are eight subsets next fourth one null set null set is a subset of itself huh? therefore only null set has subset itself means null set answer is only null set continue how many elements in the p of a a a null set null set you known that it is a no element so zero so 2 raised to 0 my answer is only and only one again repeat you students null set have no element but here are asking power set of a so students you known that power set of a formula 2 raised to m so i mention here 2 raised to 0 so my answer is 1 n raised to 0 is 1 so pa has only one element next give the following is a intervals very easy minus 4 to open bracket 6 to close bracket it means students minus 4 are counted or not yes minus 4 not counted And six is a counted or not? Yes, six is a counted because it is less than or equal to given. So my answer is a open bracket minus four to close bracket six. Second, here minus twelve less than to minus ten. It means minus twelve not counted and minus ten also not counted. So my answer is both are in the open bracket minus twelve comma minus ten. One more. Zero less than or equal to x less than seven. So students here zero counted or not? Yes, zero is a counted data. And seven counted or not? No, because seven only given less than seven means seven not counted. It means this interval are represent close to open. So close are zero, but seven are open. And last one, three less than or equal to x less than or equal to four. Students here both number are counted. so both are represent in the close bracket 3 to close bracket 4 to close bracket actually are easy example given in your textbook to understanding our intervals form next seventh in the set builder form now interval given you write down set builder form so given question in the minus 3 to 0 both are in open bracket means minus 3 not counted 0 not counted so i mention minus 3 less than x less than 0 Second, close to close given. Six close, six twelve. It means six counted, twelve counted. So minus uh, six less than or equal to x less than or equal to twelve. One more open bracket six, but twelve close. It means six not counted, but twelve are counted. And last minus twenty three counted, 
phi not counted because minus 23 in close bracket given phi in open bracket given so my answer is minus 23 less than or equal to but phi is a open bracket it means only less than phi next what universal set would you purpose for the following it means you just find out this both questions have what is a universal a right angle triangle is universal or set of isosceles triangle very easy first one for the set of right angle triangles universal set can be the set of the triangle or it is set polynomials means it is a higher set second is not a higher set for the set of isosceles triangle the universal set can be set of triangles or the polynomial set of the two dimension figure that's why my answer is a universal set is your isosceles triangle or right angle it is a right angle because right angle have also included isosceles triangle so first answer is my answer next ninth one given examples 1 2 3 and 4 you just declare what is the universal very easy a is a subset 1 3 5 2 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 b is also subset there c not subset to 0 to 6 that's why set 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 cannot be the universal set of the abc next null set have also not the universal set third third check 0 to 10 it means third option check i so a subset in 0 to 10 b subset also 0 to 10 c subset 0 to 10 it means students abc element present in the third option 0 to 10 that's why my answer is a surely that is my universal set and fourth is also a is a subset 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 b is also but c not subset therefore my correct answer is third one third one is my universal set according to i just represently a b and c value okay yes students congratulations again you happily complete your period three in the set theory period 3 ending year and as well as i give you one of the little thought for you go as far as you can see and you will see further again repeat go as far as you can see and you will see further so definitely students here our chapter 1 set theory period 3 end year and further study I will explain you in the next period four. Okay. So thank you for watching. Thank you. Thank you again. Thank you very much.